no idea why it's pissing me off i've probably tried like 30 times already and they're like tiny clips everything else will upload to instagram to snapchat everything else i can think of vine whatever just not youtube why i don't know I also don't have any kind of decent video editing program. I also don't have a way to intermix video clips. It's a pain in my ass. My old computers worked better. Whatever, everything I have on my computer right now is either obsolete, whatever. It's like a ton of issues. So, sorry about that. I guess I'm just going to have clips. If these dinky little clips ever get uploaded, they'll just be clips here and a clip there. And yeah, it'll suck, but whatever. We'll get over it. So you can see it's very glowy over here, or the glowy, gleamy light, because my Christmas tree is right over there. And Heidi still hasn't finished decorating it yet. There's still like a few things. Um, Mr. Long and I went out today, and it is a cloudy, dark day. Very cloudy, dark day. The whole day. It's not as dark as yesterday. Yesterday was super dark, but it's still dark. Definitely a dark day. I actually wore sunglasses too, and I don't know why. Maybe I'm just used to it. It would sporadically have little big, actually not little, but big fat drops of rain, but like sparse, like spread out. Like you'd once in a while get a big fat drop of water, nail you in the head really hard, and then nothing, and then you'd walk like a yard or two, and then it would like, you know, slam into your hair, shoulder, whatever, you'd be like, ow, weird, so I got um, some stuff from my daughter, she had a Christmas list, there's actually a box right here of stuff for my nieces and nephews in Jersey, New Jersey, not Europe, um, <laughs> anyways, um, and I got stuff that she wanted on her list. The majority of whatever's on her list, which isn't a very big list, is stuff that you can only get online. Um, although one thing maybe I could get, I don't know. One more thing, anyway. Um, everything she got, I am actually envious of, and I kind of want them now, too. More than kind of. Um, but the thing that I really, 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 really wanted, one of them anyway, I don't know if you can see, there's a bag right here behind, there's a roll, some rolls of wrapping paper, and then there's the box here, right, there's this white bag that's behind it, with some blue writing, I don't know if you can see that, that's from Pier 1, and I got something I wanted. I wanted to video blog about this yesterday, but I didn't get to finish it because it was interrupted and I never got to redo it. <sighs> Life. It happens. And uh, I apparently have a call for my job. Uh, I didn't know because now they email me to my iPad, this iPad thingy that I have. And don't email me to my email account, which I check all day long. And is this video still uploading? Let's see. No, it doesn't. Can't, can't get anything freaking uploaded to YouTube from my phone at all. It's so frustrating. I'm, I'm even shocked that the one that uploaded yesterday even uploaded at all. <sighs> What's the point of doing video on your phone, on your iPhone, if you can't even, like, upload it? I don't know. <sighs> But I've been sharing some stuff to Instagram. Um, when I went to Walmart, there really wasn't that many people there. I was expecting more people there because usually there is more people. But there wasn't. And that was this morning, like late this morning. Um, we got toilet paper. Uh, we didn't shop any anywhere else in the mall because there wasn't anything that we immediately needed or wanted or had money for. So then we headed over to Michael's, which is down the street from the mall, across the street and down the street. Um, Michael's is like an arts and crafts place, like AC Moore, but there's no more AC Moore at the mall, so that's why we didn't go to AC Moore. And stuff that my daughter was looking for was a pain in the ass, to, or that she wanted, it was hard to find. I had to hunt it down. And when I first got into Michael's, there was like no one there. There was really not that many customers there. There was like empty parking spaces and stuff like that. 
And then by the time I finally found what I wanted, everybody else sort of went into that aisle. And I was like, what the heck? Why are all these people here? So as I finally get what we wanted and we are about to go to in line, um, next thing you know, the whole store was just filled with people shopping. Also, I didn't know you could just go Christmas shopping for just toys and stuff at Michael's. I thought it was just like arts and crafts and like building things and like glue and tools and stuff like that and maybe fabrics. Um, but you can get, I mean, of course, you could probably get food stuff too because AC More does that. But you could get toys and pajamas and gloves and like all kinds of bric a brac at, at Michael's. I didn't know that. Um, yeah, so I had to actually stand in line. This is like, this has never really happened to me and ever Christmas shopping in like years where I actually had to stand in a line, like, because there's usually no one ever shopping. <laughs> and I've run my own businesses at Christmas time. So that's pretty weird. The only time I've actually had to stand in line to buy stuff at Christmas time that I can think of was at Walmart. And people weren't usually Christmas shopping. They were buying like toilet paper or detergent or food or something like taco packages of taco mix or something taco kits whatever um so that was that was different it was really weird really weird yeah um i actually stood in line wow i haven't done that since like 2002 yeah yeah that i can think of Even when I went shopping with Libby back like a few years ago in Jersey, we didn't even have to stand in line. We just you go to the register. There's if there's somebody there's one it's one or two people and that's it. This was like actually like a line that like snaked around and for real, yeah, for real. And it's a Tuesday and it's not Cyber Monday or anything. So I have a call. I had my call later. Oh, something else I got at um, Michael's. I got these do-it-yourself kind of cafe looking coffee cups. I've never seen this ever other than I haven't even seen anything as nice as this even at BJ's. And they have these little packs and they had different designs on them. And it's like a disposable cup. I was just like, wow, it's a dollar. I need it. So I got it. Then after I went to Michael's, um, Michael's is right next to Pier 1. I never was into Pier 1 until like this year because we walked into there um, today and they actually had stuff I liked before. I always felt like they had stuff I wasn't interested in like years and years ago. And I always thought it was like for old lady yuppies or something. Except maybe that's me. I don't know. <laughs> um... And there was these lanterns that I really liked, and he got me one, and that's what, that's what that bag is, the Pure One bag thingy is. And uh, I guess that's about it for now, so not very exciting, but exciting for me, because I was really happy that I got a lantern, because he told me no, like, a bunch of times, and then he said yes to this. I didn't get a big one, but I got one. It's ice blue, and it has, like, a jewel on it, and it's, like, brass underneath with, like, ice blue, like, antiquing on it. 